Hello everyone and welcome back to Fashionable Nari. So today I am sharing with you how you can make patterns from your already own dress or recreate your favorite dresses. And in the next video I will show you how to sew it all together and the final look. So make sure you hit the subscribe and notification bell to be notified. Now without any delay let's see the materials. I am using 2 meters of printed cotton twill. 1 meter of cotton lining, measuring marking cutting tools, along with some pearl pin, quarter inch elastic, matching thread and buttons. And of course, an old dress for drafting. We will start by turning the dress inside out. As you can see, it has this yoke style back. I will first trace that out. Make sure your dress is crease free, that's when you will get the appropriate shape. Now I'm just tracing the basic shape in an A4 sheet and later I will perfect it with a French curve and a ruler. So this is how it will look. Now the pattern we created is without sewing allowance and I will trace it in another sheet to give the sewing allowance and I will do it once all the required patterns are ready. Using the same method of tracing now I am making the front part of the dress. Now as you can see on the curvy edge I have given half an inch sewing allowance and one inch on either sides. As 
and keeping the patterns and cutting the main fabric so you can lay the fabric right side facing and then just trace the pattern and cut them out next is to cut a lot of 1.5 inches of bias strip and lining fabric for the finishing of the dress then to make the loose gathered skirt i marked the desired length and twice the measurement of my waist for an example if your waist size is 24 inches you need to cut 48 inches of longer length that depends on how fuller you want the skirt to be One inch of long straight strips for sleeveless shoulder straps. So by using this method, you can trace any style that you want to and create number of designs. I hope you like what you see. Please consider subscribing for more such fun DIY videos. See you in the next one. Bye bye.